Prabhupada ki, Jai Gopinath ki, Jai Gornitai ki, Jai Jagannath Baldev Subhadra ki, Jai Sanaveda Bhakta Vrinda ki, Jai Very happy to see so many wonderful devotees here tonight for this, uh, this program of uh, Siksha, sometimes known as uh, Spiritual Achievers uh, Recognition. It's actually just to give blessings and encouragement to the devotees who are uh, taking more spiritual responsibility for their for their uh, uh, spiritual life. The idea is that on one hand, uh, devotees on their own, they gradually take more and more responsibility, enthusiasm. And as was mentioned by uh, a temple president that uh, going up basically there's certain steps in their spiritual life. Now he mentioned the word vow. Actually we don't usually use that word uh, vow until we get to initiations. Because uh, a vow is a very serious kind of a commitment uh, where this is more like a, a kind of a intention, a personal, a personal commitment. We don't ask you to make a vow before the deities or the fire or anything, uh, but that this is your intention, that you, you're, you've been doing it already or intend to do it, and uh, in order to get that blessing from the support from everyone, blessing of a <coughs> young year, so that uh, ceremony is being performed. But technically there's no uh, vow that's being made until one takes the initiation. But there's this personal commitment. <coughs> so we want to encourage people to make these commitments. Krishna says that uh, According to how you approach me, I reciprocate with you. If someone is more committed in their spiritual life and this is more committed to helping you. Prabhupada once uh, explained that if someone takes it as their duty to serve Krishna, then Krishna takes it as his duty to protect that devotee. How many would like to be protected by Krishna? Wow. <laughs> Some people, they wonder why things happen to me. Why God lets this happen, but we don't necessarily do anything for Him. We don't. We don't really offer any uh, spiritual offerings uh, uh, for Him. So then, if we don't take any special interest, then in, uh, why should He take a special interest in us? Prahlad was thinking of Krishna day and night. He was thinking of Krishna 24/7. And so Krishna was uh, completely protecting him, also, all the time, no matter what happened. 